the search for the oldest known slaughter map somehow continues. Last time we looked at squid.pod, claiming to be from 1980, but actually is probably from mid-94, maybe as early as April 94. The oldest confirmed date that we looked at was amanda.pod, which is from July of 1994. Well, earlier today I was watching the really cool DSDA Twitch stream. Uh, by the way, if you haven't seen that or didn't know about it, go check it out. It's a Twitch stream of random record runs from the DSDA archive. If you're a Doom fan, it's really great fun to watch or even just have on in the background. So seriously, check it out, link in the description. Anyway, a particular run that I saw caught my eye. It was a one-map wad simply called Barrel. It's a rework of E1M1 with a bunch of new monsters and, well, obviously, barrels added in. It looked really fun, and I can now confirm it is actually really, really fun to play. But after downloading it, something else caught my eye. The WAD file is dated as 28th of March 1994. Now this is a bit mysterious because it doesn't really come with a proper text file, so I don't know anything about it, and I couldn't find anything about it online really, so if you know something about it, please leave a comment. But if that date is accurate, does this map count as slaughter? Could this map continue the quest to find the oldest known slaughter map? Well, no matter what, it is a tons of fun and I'm going to show the map to you. The run that I saw was by the incredible and well known of course Doom speedrunner for Shock Blast. He did a UV max in just under 32 seconds. I will never beat that time, but I thought what better way to showcase this map than to do some on-camera attempts just to see what is the best time that I can get. I think the map lends itself really well to that kind of play, speedrunning. The first ever record for the map on DSDA was 51 seconds. Earlier today I got 42. So can I get all the kills and secrets faster than 42 seconds? So to see the map, to decide if you think it's also a slaughter map, and to see my noobish attempts at speedrunning, Stay tuned. I hope you enjoy getting to witness Barrel.Word. Maybe from March of 1994, and maybe, maybe a slaughter map. Okay, it's time to play Barrel.Word and see if I can beat my time from this afternoon of 42 seconds, which would put me midway on the leaderboard on DSDA, I think. Let's see how we go here. This talking over speedrun attempts make me play worse. I assume it will. We need to tag that. Yeah, focused, focused. I'm locked in. Don't care that there's not many kills. Oh, thank you. They took each other out. Oh my god. This guy, oh, I hear breathing. I think they haven't. Yeah. The last guy is going to be up in here. You can be unlucky sometimes and the last dude doesn't die from up in there. Alright, attempt number one. Almost. It was a very good one, actually. Uh, and yeah, this strategy that I'm employing, I've just made up myself. I didn't watch anyone else's demos other than uh, Four Shock Blasts sort of casually a few hours ago. I, uh, but I don't remember the route that he took at all. I remember being more sort of you know, interested in looking at the level itself than what it exactly he was doing. Okay. Oh, this guy needs to die. He's got to tag these secrets. That's one of the toughest parts of all this. Okay. Yes, he died. Get those kills, get those kills. Perfect. And... Oh, no. Crappy movement there. 43. So I got 42 earlier this afternoon. I reckon with enough grinding and some good RNG in my favor, I could maybe get like a 39. But yeah, for Shock Blast record of basically 32, slightly under 32 seconds is, you know, suitably crazy for a player of four Shock Blast caliber. And yeah, their route's probably better than what I'm doing right here now. But yeah, there's not much map to show off here, so I figure Playing it several times going for a good time is one of the only ways to spin this out into a few minutes of interest. Otherwise you'd see just like, you know, 30 seconds. Also, yeah, I'm very deliberately not using the 180 turn key because 
That is banned under current DSDA rules. Oh crap, that's all the kills. Oh, and I've made it to the secrets. Quick. Oh no, that movement. I blocked myself on the wall there. If not for that, I might have got my 42 again or a 41. Okay. Lock in. Let's see, I try and shoot these barrels on the way through. I bugged it up this time, of course. Right, and then you got to just push in here. You might cop a bit of damage. Oh, this room's already clear. That's great. Got to come in here to tag the secret. You got to come in here to make the uh, lift out there go down, and you may as well kill the imps while you're at it. These guys got to just push through. Hope that you don't get damaged. Okay, fire a rocket up here in case that hadn't happened. It hadn't. I see you. I see you. All the kills. Oh my god. No, the door. 40. I can definitely get a sub 40. Uh, how long have I been? Three minutes. Okay, I said I'd do like five. Let's just do a few more. I won't, you know, look at the timer on OBS strictly. Oh, well, this is just terrible. I'll do a couple more. But yeah, that run right there, I got 40, so I can definitely do better than 40. I could get a 30-something. Oh, they were already exploded. I know the start of this one was really bad, but for some reason I feel compelled to continue. And maybe it's because I could just sense that there was good RNG on the monsters taking out their own barrels. Okay, really sketchy that those barrels are still there behind me. But yep, they're taken out. It's just these guys. Okay, who else is alive? Four kills. You're one of them. Yeah. You're one of them. Two guys in here? No, okay. Two dudes still somewhere. This happens sometimes, and you may as well just restart. Yeah. Forwards are, if I'd have hit that, this had been a really good start. Gotta just push through these guys. I mean, you do... Under my strats, this probably isn't optimal. I don't know. And you can get good luck with the dudes up in the top area with the armor bonuses having already taken themselves out by this point. Doesn't sound like it. Ah, uh, this guy's totally thrown me off. I wouldn't have made it to the lift in time. Like the secret lift. Ouch. Okay, yes, see, I got it. Getting that on, you know, an early vantage point is good and then if these guys could just take each other out a bit quicker that'd be some good rng that maybe i'd be able to uh leverage into a sub 40 run need to grab this med kit i think uh oh, the barrel here didn't explode it still didn't it's not so bad because you can probably take out the zombie men on the way to the exit anyway but these guys haven't died come on just leave me with the zombie men. Oh, there's still one kill left somewhere. <laughs> Doesn't matter where at that point. It's not going to happen. Oh, auto-aim. Hitting the pinkies. Oh, see, they're already exploded. That's probably what I should be doing if I really want to push this time down. It's not even bothering to fire at that window. Just wait for a run where they kill it themselves. Just grind this map over and over again until you get really good RNG with the monsters taking out the barrels for you. Okay. That was a pretty decent turnaround for a keyboard player. Oh, how have I missed the lift there? There was two kills left anyway. Ideally, you want all the kills at that point. I think that's how I got my 40 run, right? Come on. Should be firing more. How are these barrels still there? I was so, yeah, I was so annoyed with that run. I even took my hand off the keyboard. Okay, got to push forwards here. That's too far forwards. Completely unnecessary loss of health. Having more, okay, that was a good hit of the barrel, just like straight through those dudes. Definitely going to push on, even though my health's bad. So you just never know. There is a med kit right there. I feel like it is often worth grabbing. Got the secrets. Cool. 
that guy. I hear breathing in here. There was that guy. And there's still one kill somewhere. Heartbreaking, although I wasn't going to break my 40 second barrier anyway. Bit of off the cuff live speed running on the channel for the first time ever. I do actually do this sometimes in my spare time. I mean, I have a UV Max record on uh, Endgame Map 8. Whoa! Good RNG, really good RNG. They even opened the door for me. Oh, and they're killing each other. Holy crap. Oh, I'm missing a kill. He's right here. Oh, he's all the way back there. I thought it was the zombie man. That is heartbreaking. That Okay, but that's the kind of RNG that I need to get a 30-something. But with that kind of RNG, using my strat and at my skill level, I think a mid-30s is possible if I just got godly RNG. In terms of like the monsters taking out the barrels themselves. Kind of like this. Kind of almost like that. Ooh, that's a better strat anyway, what I just did there. Open the door to here first, get a shot off, then turn to the side and do the side door. I have to try and remember to use that going forwards. Okay, this guy. And I think a zombie man. Yes, it was. Oh, if I didn't hesitate there. Well, there you go. There's the 42 that I got the salvo, but I already have a 40. And I should, with better luck and enough grinding, I can get a 30-something. Seen it. We've seen it. We've seen the possibility. It didn't happen. Oh, wow, that was good. I just have to hold back a bit or else we'll die to the barrels. Okay. Do this. Open this door. Shoot that. While they explode, do this. Much more efficient use of the time. Okay, that zombie man is fine. I'll be back for him soon. Take out these. Tag. Tag. Rocket. Zombie man. No, the kills! Man, that was going to be it. Where is the last guy? Where is he? I need to know. After you ruined my run. He'll be up here. Oh, we'll be able to hear him breathing. Actually, I have no idea. Oh, this is all the way back here, man. There it was, though. There it was. With better luck, that guy would have been dead. And I would have got, what was that, like 36, 37? Oh, they're already dead outside. If only I knew, I wouldn't have bothered to look. Let's go, let's go, let's go. That's a problem pushing through here so soon. Is those guys, Well, that's already... All taken care of in there. Got really good RNG here. You hear that zombie man? That's okay. I haven't. Oh, don't block me like that. It's so annoying you have to actually walk in there to tag the secrets. Oh, well, what? Okay, well. You. And two other kids. Get in there, I'm getting there. I think this is well over five minutes now, but this is fun. This map is incredibly fun. There's something really fun about this. The barrels everywhere adds just this, like, several extra really awesome dimensions to getting a UV Max on E1M1. I mean, it is a famously well-designed and fun deathmatch map. It's got a good layout that's conducive to, like, various types of fun gameplay. And this is another one of them. <laughs> Really well done. I mean, it's such a simple idea. It's, you know, dude opens up Doom Builder for the first time, throws barrels everywhere, it's the whole thing, but damn if they didn't put them in a really cool spot. Die, damn it. If that guy had died, this could have been. That had potential, that run. If I wasn't distracting myself with what I was talking and playing badly, or just playing badly. Like, maybe I wasn't being distracted at all. I was just executing what limited skills I have badly. Oh, go on, go on, go on, go on. Imagine if the exit door was open there as well. I think I have to walk in here, though, to lower the lift over here. And tag these. These guys aren't dead yet. And I know there's a zombie man still. A couple of them, maybe even. Several. Oh, and these guys didn't die, but 
neither did two others. Okay, I've gone <laughs> for almost three times as long as I thought I would. So I guess I may as well just set a 15 minute limit on myself and then leave it at that. 40 seconds I'm pretty damn proud of already, like I did it. But I know I can get 30 something now, that's why I wanted to keep going. 30 something is definitely very possible for me. 32, I highly doubt. <laughs> as in, very highly doubt. I'm not going to be pushed for Shock Blast. But considering that I'm a keyboard player who isn't a speedrunner, um, a 30 something I'm very happy with. Okay, you. Oh, well, what am I even doing? Like, if I'm. Any run that hasn't already. Going, you know, has potential to beat 40 seconds, I should just give up on. Gotta do these things. Okay, yep. They're dying. Oh, this is bad. It's a big hold up there. Gotta keep shooting through all those exploding barrels. Of course, it came straight at me. Uh, to make sure that... I'm still taking out the barrels that I need to. Uh, oh, there's two of them. I shouldn't have stopped to shoot at that guy. Well, obviously they're dead. And yeah, I'm not going to get 40 seconds. You were one of them. You do, it would seem, well, under my strat, you do need good luck in the sense that monsters just die. I wonder if I can just show myself to these guys and just pray that they shoot the barrels themselves in the future. Actually took the hand off the keyboard to uh, scratch my nose during a serious speedrun attempt. Casual player confirmed. Uh, I'm gonna have to come here for this. No, I missed. Oh my god. Bad RNG on the damage roll there. The barrel didn't explode. Let's try this. Oh, they've already killed themselves. See, that's what I probably should be grinding for. Like, if I was really serious about trying to get the best time possible. Just, um... Run past and don't even look out the window and just hope that they've killed themselves. <laughs> Wasn't even paying attention to my health there. I mean, we can try... Oh, well, not there. We can try that. I assume I'm getting really close to 15 minutes now. Just sort of show myself at the window while I take out these barrels and then just push through. Hope the guys outside take care of themselves. Wow, everyone in here did. Problem is, yeah, see, they haven't, so I've had to stop there and do that. Oh no, the door. I wasn't probably going to get sub 40 anyway, but yeah, I know one of the dudes still alive is a zombie man in here. Damn, I was hoping it was two zombie men. That's why I just did that. Uh, it'll be a guy up there. Alright, it's 16 minutes. One last run. Whatever I get on this run, that's it. Bad start. Like, I'm going to go back to that strat. At least it's a lot more consistent. Okay, pushing through, not forgetting to shoot, because ideally these would have already exploded by now. No good RNG on the door opening in here. At least I've just naturally incorporated the strat of, like, opening those doors at the same time. It's a lot more efficient. Oh, yep, took each other out. I needed that after that sloppy movement with this guy. And I hear dudes in here, I think. Yes. Oh my god. Alright, well, the final run was an exit at 43. So I can consistently beat what was the record back in 2002, over 20 years ago. Uh, and I, I think from what I just saw there, I think most of you probably agree, with enough grinding I could definitely get a 30-something. But I got a 40. And yeah, just a really cool map made in March of 1994. Crazy. 28th of March, I think it was if the date on the what is to be believed. Really, really fun, like really fun, surprisingly fun. And that's basically the main reason I highlighted this map was just, it's super fun. I highly recommend, check the link in the description, um, download the map and have a play. It is really fun. If you, Even if you're not a speedrunner, if even if that's not your thing, it's still fun to try to get a good time on this map. It's not really, you know, 
it's, it's not a grindy style of speed run it's just like that's the way the map seems to be meant to be played and it's good you know it's just it's well designed the placement of the barrels and the monsters is just maybe by accident really really cool anyway i hope you enjoyed and uh i'll see you in the next video that i do and until then have a good day week month whatever and peace <laughs>